You know how you get that one client say, can you give me a closure sew in without lace glue? And you know I can. Let's get into it. So today the client want to do a closure sew in without lace glue. So we're going to do this new technique where I'm going to sew the closure in behind her natural hairline. So to get started off, I'm going to start braiding her down. Y'all know how I feel. You don't have a good sew in if you don't have a good foundation. So once I get it all sewed in, we're going to use kinky straight hair. And then the client ordered her hair from Amazon. I do not know the vendor, but she did say she went by the top stars and not by the cheap ass price. So once we get her oil down, we're going to go ahead and start sewing her hair in. This kinky straight hair blended in great with her natural hair. So once we get our initial um, sewing started, we're going to start doubling up because she did have three bundles and she wanted it nice and full. Once I get it sewed into a certain part, I'm going to start focusing on this closure. Then when it comes down to this closure, I don't have to pluck it, which saved a lot of time. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut this lace off right at the hairline because we're going to place this closure directly behind her natural leave out. Now, before y'all get in my comments, if you don't have no edges, sweetie, this technique is not for you, okay? This is for the full edge girlies only. So we're going to get her to hold this down because we're going to have to sew this down on both sides and all the way around. So once we get this put in, it's going to look so natural. And then we're going to go ahead and suck it out and this is going to be your final result. And as always, hit that follow button. 